Hi everyone, it is Chrissy from Station Stickers. Today we are going to do a plan with me um, using Kit 16 um, for the week of August 9th. And um, initially I had planned to put this up on Saturday, but the audio wasn't good. So it is Tuesday and I'm doing a quick voiceover, so hopefully it's okay. Before we get started, be sure to click the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, it really helps out our channel. And um, yeah, we'll go ahead and get started. So we are using our A5 Agenda um, inserts in a binder. Um, I'll link the binder below. I purchased it from Amazon, actually. Um, I don't know if it's still available, but I'll try to find something um, equivalent since a lot of people have been asking. Um, and I'm just flipping through the kit right here. The theme is a back to school kit. As you can tell, um, we went ahead and started with Monday. I decided to not white out the bottom area because um, you can't really see it through too much. And I tried to avoid using white unless I really need to. Um, but anyways, yes, Monday was her first day back. Um, she would definitely was not happy to go back to school. Um, but what can you do? Anyways, so I put down the bottom box as well as the um, checklist and then as well as the little flag on the side to separate my box. Um, typically, um, like you've seen before, I usually split it up for typical errands at the top and then stuff for the shop below. Um, being a mom who works part-time um, as well as runs a sticker shop, I like to keep everything organized by tasks so that way I do an even amount of store stuff as well as mommy life stuff. But anyways, so I went ahead and put down the um, bottom, uh, I put down the quarter box, um, a quarter time stamp to, to mark um, the preschool drop off. Um, she is going to school from eight to new or eight to one now. Initially summer school was eight to 12. So it's, it's definitely a little bit longer. Um, and then I went ahead and whited out the top part since I usually mark memory there. I'm probably just going to do a little doodle on how she did today at school. And then I'm um, at some photos as well. And then I went ahead and marked um, my workout, which I did when I came back right afterwards. Um, and then the bottom box, I usually do my wellness. Um, that usually includes um, my meals, my vitamins, um, my hydration, and basic things like that. I've been trying to be a little bit more mindful of taking a uh, multivitamin every day um, since I have been on a diet and not eating as um, much like calcium as I used to and different things like that. Um, so anyways, um, vitamins don't always taste the best, but what can you do? So initially when I marked this, I thought she finished at noon, um, but that did have to be extended down to one o'clock. Um, the ruler I use is from Amazon. It's actually really nice. So if you decide that you want it, um, I'll link it below in my Amazon store. Um, it was such a good deal. Um, but I use those actually to prop up when it, um, our silhouette machines as well as to you know draw lines. Um, but anyways, my daughter had a class at um, one o'clock, which we had to move to two o'clock. And then I had a meeting at 2.15. So that did overlap. So I did have to get some help from my parents to do her class. Um, but I couldn't find my class stickers anywhere, so um, I need to reorganize my sticker stick my sticker collection and put it in front of me before I film this. Um, it is at a different table, so I don't want to be running back and forth. Um, so, anyways, I did do a lot of writing in myself for this week since I didn't have all the stickers set. I spent most of the weekend just like designing and then. Um, processing your guys' order because I, I, I like to get them out as soon as possible. I think we actually just finished shipping out everything from this weekend, so it was awesome. Um, so if you decide to pick anything up, it's in the shop. Um, everything has been restocked and stuff, so just so you know, um, processing times have been much improved after um, the new techniques we've been using to process everything. Anyways, so on Tuesday, which is today, um, Again, I use the same pattern header on both sides just because I like how it serves. When I open up the page, it looks sort of nice um, for me to use. Anyways, um, so Tuesday, drop off again, and then went to go get some gas. Um, and then I forgot, I put the bottom box on the bottom right again. Um, and, you know, to be honest, like if you wanted to plan minimally, you don't need to put, you know, the stuff on the right side of the box on the right you can just free text it you know or just use like one of the labels or washi strips and 
keep it very simple um, I do see some people you know just using that top washi banner um, with the date date covers and stuff and that's all they use and it looks great you know um, planning should be what you want from it and what makes you happy so um, for me you know using these little blocks of time make it more fun for me to do things um, when I write down like what I need to do um, but anyways so preschool drop off at 8 30 this morning and then um, after I finish doing this voiceover which I didn't get to mark at that time I will be doing um, workout and then going out to run some more errands um but yeah so in case you didn't know on the last page of the kit if you purchase the whole kit there are um the pattern boxes and those span the whole width of it so um i usually mark use that to mark down like special things and stuff and then the box that i use there it's the same box we use for the top right to cover the date date like um date times i guess um when you span it like vertically it actually spans like a good like chunk of time like five hours i think um but anyways so after i pick up my daughter i'll probably come home and just um do some website updates and stuff um we are transitioning from um printables to printed just because it's easier and then I may just do separate listings for printables a separate section so that way when people purchase they don't get confused um, so it's just gonna take a lot of time because there are a lot of listings and you know um, being a mom I you know mom duties have to come first so thank you for understanding and you know taking that into consideration when you're shopping from our store um, we're not being as um, active as we used to be in the past when it comes to like releasing as often and things like that just you know doing what um what i can do and have finding a balance you know that's the biggest thing when it comes to you know what you can do for yourself and stuff focusing on what makes you happy so balance between the two um but yes so wednesday i drop my daughter i plan to drop my daughter off before i go to work and then i work a full shift um no extra duties this week it looks like and then coming home and then we have meals already prepped for this week since we've been trying to be better um, with meal prepping. And then um, treadmill usually in the evening and then um, just a list of general errands since I won't be able to do anything for the store that day. Just be focusing on things I need to do like at work as well as around the house. Um, and then just I try to do a memory thought or memory I guess memory keeping every other day in this so that way like when I move it over to my memory planner which I don't usually film on here um, I have like fun facts and things like that so um, my memory isn't the best um, so this is the way I keep track of everything um, I also marked in there my daughter does have a class at three o'clock which my my parents do with her via zoom and then I put in for some of the errands where I have meetings to set up as well as modules I have to do for work so moving on to Thursday, same thing. Um, I'm going to have to do a preschool drop off. Um, my daughter just, her school is about an, like an exit away from where I work, which is great on days where I work, uh, but not so great on days where I don't work since it's like a 25 minute drive. But uh, we love the teacher she's with and everything. So we're just going to, you know, continue with that for now. Um, but yes, again, just a general list for errands. Um, I realize that um, I love the checklist so much. I'm going to come out with like a pastel version. So that would be in the functional section. So stay tuned for that. I need to slowly expand that um, when I get a chance. So it'll be slowly headed to the shop. Um, but anyways, again, you know, with work being marked um, from 8 to 5, I usually stay an hour or two later finishing all my work um, and then coming home and then um, preschool drop up four no meetings this week and no extra duties on the Thursday as well um, but I my daughter does have a class at five o'clock as well so that her, my parents would do with her again and I think that's pretty much it for Thursday um, actually no I looked at my schedule I think I do have a meeting on that day so I went ahead and mark that um, on that Friday, I actually um, marked, initially when I had planned this, I was going to work on Friday, um, but I think I decided to take it off um, for my husband's birthday this past, this upcoming weekend, just so I can prepare um, with just, you know, things around the house, cleaning everything and setting up like um, we are going to be going to the beach 
um, this Sunday, it looks like. Um, we got, like, um, a tent and, like, shade, shade stuff. And, like, I just have to go around and pick up, like, a few things um, for the event. And it's not going to be a big thing with, like, a bunch of people. It's just going to be us, um, my, maybe my parents, and then, like, his niece is coming along as well. And then we're just going to have, you know, just relax at home and just do relax on the beach and then just enjoy the um just enjoy the ocean and stuff um anyways so yeah so initially I thought I was working so hence why I marked work and then I will be taking that off my actual planner um the good thing is you know everything I use um is removable um or on removable matte stickers um so easily peel that up I just probably have to use like a long vertical sticker to cover that um the little line that I drew to mark the time but anyways um Friday oh it is also payday on Friday so I marked that um payday for work anyways not for the, the shop um and then went ahead and tried to figure out what color works best so I went ahead and added that as well the little box at top um I'll probably fill in um, everything as I go. I'm sure everybody else is the same when it comes to their planner. I usually put it next to my bed stand the, and then brain dump the night before. So um, the next morning, it's nice and simple. I just wake up and I already have a list of things I need to do. Um, and yeah, so I'm sure you notice there's a lot of stickers that mark workout. Um, this last month or so, I've been focusing on my workouts and my health as much as possible. Um, hence, there's not been that many like stickers they added to the shop and stuff and not being able to do as much um, just because, you know, I'm trying to find a good balance between the two. Um, goal is to lose a certain amount of weight, you know, before my birthday in September. Um, and I am halfway there right now. So um, another halfway, hopefully I will reach my goal. So we'll see. Um, I am alternating between um, doing cardio as well as weights. Initially it was just cardio, um, but I had recommendations to do some weights in between. So um, workout can alternate between, you know, cardio, hit workouts. Um, I do have a Peloton account. Um, that is free because um, I have a chase card. Um, so I've been just doing hit workouts through there and then just alternating days and taking a pretty much break day on the two days I go into work on Wednesday and Thursday. Um, but Saturday, I think um, the plan is that um, my husband's probably going to do an extra shift in the morning and I am going to take my daughter to my parents' house just to get out of the house. Um, my sister's place ha does have a pool, so we probably will be doing that in the morning, just do some family time. And then when my husband gets back, um, we'll just be hanging out at home, doing any errands we need to. And then I do have to go pick up his cake um, from this bakery um, around six o'clock um, for the following day so we can have it all set to go. Um, and then pretty much get ready, prep the car for the beach for the next day. Um, as you can see there, um, I did have a sheet of just like a bunch of scripts. Um, the reason why I do that is just have, sometimes I just have extra pa like space on a page when I print stickers, um, that I usually just add those on. Um, but yeah, anyways, um, I think that's pretty much it. Sunday, we just get to spend time at the beach and then um, relax, have good food, um, and nothing too exciting other than that, just, you know, spending time with family. Um, there's no new releases this week. The next release is going to be the following week on Saturday, and it's going to be our kit release for the following month. We're just alternating every two weeks um, between kit releases and then functional items. So hopefully that, you know, you like how that's set up. So it's not too much in one week and too much in one month. And, um, you find what you like, you know, when we release those in the future. Um, I really like how they turned out. So I hope you guys like them too, but I think that's pretty much it. Um, I just kept it sort of simple on Sunday and, and then usually update the website, you know, on Sunday with any restocks we have printed and stuff. And I think that's pretty much it. I think I'm just slowly going in and just adding a few things here and there. Um, but it's pretty much it, I think, for the end of the video. Um, if you have any questions or concerns, anything that you're interested, um, 
to see, you know, in more detail, let me know. Uh, but most of the stickers are from our shop. And um, I think that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Hopefully you like the voice over a little bit better than um, just the regular plan with me. So because it goes a little bit faster. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye bye.